Caroline Bling. Hey. <laughs> Real representatives that we have a caller on the line. Caller, what's your name? Where are you from? Hi, Lonnie. Hi. <laughs> what's your name, sweetie? Where are you from? Naisha. I'm from San Diego. San Diego. San Diego. Yes. I right hear you need our advice on something going on in your life. What can we help you with? I recently broke up with my significant other, oh. and we've been friends for five years prior to that. And I want to know when is the right time to know, okay, you need to be friends with them or you need to just let them go. How long were oh. you dating? You, you knew him for five years. How long were you dating? Two. So a total of seven years y'all been together, like knowing each other. No, five. Five, five total. Five total, okay. Okay. How, right. how did he behave in the breakup? Was he kind in the breakup or was he nasty? <laughs> oh, very, kind of like not. Line. Okay. Did, did you break up or he broke up? I broke up. Yeah. Okay. And why? Because <laughs> <laughs> um, he was not your <laughs> No. There's other people involved. Oh. With you or him? With him. Okay. Okay. All right. Oh. I think we got enough. Wait, yeah. I need to picture him. Was he skinny? <laughs> <laughs> No. You have not fat, Jeannie. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm playing with you. You know what, to be honest with you, is it important to you to want to be friends with him again? Is that something you need right now? I would like him in my life, and I do see him in my future, definitely. I know I'm still young, and a lot of people say, you know, there's a lot of fish in the sea, but, you know, he was my first love, and... No, I see, okay, I gotta say, I say this. Yeah, I say see, it. I see emotional strings still yeah. attached. There's, yes. a, there's a little danger I feel Amanda, right there because, yeah, people who are supposed to be in your life will make sure they're in your life. Yeah, that's it. They'll treat you. They'll treat you Wait, the way. I, I have a question. There was another person involved. That's yeah, what he I'm cheated saying. on her. He cheated so on her. Why do you want to be friends with there somebody who cheated on you? And because you, there's emotional strength. Because that's her that. first. And I know, she's but you emotional. don't. You don't want. You don't need nope. to be friends with somebody who cheated on you, honey. And can I he say showed, one more? He showed himself already. Believe, believe him. He yeah. showed you I just himself. I want to add one more thing. Kay. Like sometimes. What we really want to do in being friends with somebody is make ourselves feel like we didn't make a mistake mm -hmm. by giving this person so much time. And so we think, like, well, maybe if we're friends, then it can rectify their wrongdoing, and then that makes you feel mm -hmm. better. Mm -hmm. But you weren't wrong in the first place. Yeah. Like, you give people space to show you who they are, yeah. and if they show you that they don't deserve that space, you let it go. Yeah. Yeah.